Hello everyone. Uh, in this video, I would like to introduce you to the Nice Inventory System. This is the final version, uh, or let's say the marketplace version. <laughs> um, before I start, let me say that if you already have the multiplayer game system, then the inventory, this in, uh, inventory system, will be included. So unless you need it for a separate project, I don't think that you need actually to buy it. Um, otherwise, yeah, uh, you can buy it to support me <laughs> if you like to. So let me show you what it does. So if we play, you can obviously pick up. Let's pick up everything in the map because new item will drop simply because I have a, a loot system and it drops random items with random stats all the time every 10 seconds but obviously you can adjust that to your need you might want to add uh, the blueprint into your enemies uh, so once they're dead they, they will drop some random item yep here we go so if you press Q you can get into the inventory UI you have your character here with the stats and uh, the level and the XP at the moment it's not, it's doing nothing but it's ready for you to hook up your XP level or you know like whatever level system you have but since this asset it's not about the leveling so it's not doing anything here but you can rotate around your character to investigate to see how how they look at the moment they are kinda naked uh, here you have all your equipment and you know armor and weapons so if you press on any of those the item viewer will pop up uh, you can rotate it delete it close like that but if you delete it it will drop it drops it on the floor let's pick it up again with the with the E button and here are all the stats for that particular item and it compares itself to whatever you have equipped since we don't have anything equipped so it's just showing its own uh, stats so let's equip it uh, let's see chest oh and one more thing you see the background is green because I have a rare rarity system so you have different colors for different uh, rare classes and you know that this item that you equipped you know it's the equipped item because it says here uh, the name is in yellow and the delete button is uh, is uh, un uh, is disabled so this is gray item so let's equip it another gray item but because I have two now I can rotate between them so let's equip this one and now you can see if I rotate it will compare this item to whatever I have equipped at the moment so this one is worse than what I have so let's delete it actually go to the trinket and I have a blue item goody goody uh, one item so let's equip this one let's equip this one okay Ah, before I equip the backpack, let me show you what it does actually. Don't have anything here, anything there. Okay, so for the weapon, if you look at the stats here, uh, they say damage, magazine size, and so on. But if you look at an, arm, uh, at an armor item, then it says health, power, strength, and so on. If you look at the backpack, it says weapon capacity, armor capacity, and so on okay so you have different capacities for different uh, item classes so like you can carry 13 weapons and 15 armor uh, backpack which is basically here I will show you what, what that is armors and other stuff whatever you want to add really uh, if I would pick up some more stuff you see now my inventory is full I can't pick any more I can't pick up any more uh, armor you see on the left corner so if I equip my backpack now so I can continue to pick up more stuff 
Now that backpack is gray, so it's not giving me a lot. Here we go, it's full already. It's not giving me a lot of spaces, but at least it's better than being naked. <laughs> Ooh, look at the cloth. I like it. I like that cloth. So now it's time to drop some stuff that we don't need. Uh, let's drop this one. Drop this one. Drink it. Drop this one. Do I have more than pa one pack? No. And this one is better. So let's drop that one. I'll pick the white ones. I like the white ones, by the way. They look far more beautiful than the reds. Let's equip you. Whites. I have only one weapon of each. Yeah, okay. So all what I dropped is on the floor here. So let's try to pick some more stuff. A poach. Oh, it's full again. Let's go to the corner and drop some stuff that we don't need. Let's hope that we get a better backpack. No, the pouch is actually smaller. Uh, not really. Okay, here we go. A slightly better backpack. Let's take it anyway. And let's drop the old one. Let's see, cape, mm, a little bit better. You see the stats is being updated, you know, depending on whatever I have equipped. So for example, uh, if you look at 199, 194, 103, 82, 95, but if I equip the other one, which is slightly better, 203, 196, and so on. So let's drop the old one. Let's see, helmets, uh, no. Chest, all right, slightly better. Drop the old one. Pants, nothing. Drink, it's still only one. Swords, we have two swords. Okay, let's take this one and drop the old one sidearm we don't have we have another weapon here nope not that good nope all right so you get the idea you know like you uh, i think it's fairly straightforward and you can understand what's going on let's see if we can find some uh white helmet pants and Oh, I didn't show you the food, didn't I? No, but I didn't. I found another backpack. Nope. So if you, uh, so here are the all the equipments here. If you go to the backpack, you see you have attachment, consumable, usable, and quest items. So let's say, for example, consumables. We have the foods that I collected earlier, and you can investigate. You can consume delete obviously and close yeah okay so here this is what was the this is what the uh, backpack is doing uh, what else do I want to show you here I think that's it really uh, for the interface and the using here we go white and another white do we have a helmet white helmet i need to complete the whole set nope it didn't drop any white helmet for me damn it slightly better Come on, white helmet, white helmet. 
let's give it a couple of seconds hopefully it will drop a white helmet Come on, come on, here we go. Nope, it's a chest. Damn it. <laughs> All right then. But here we go. This is how, how it looks inside the game. Let me show you now uh, how you actually add your items. So if you go to blueprints and then you go to the data table, this is the only thing that you need to edit given that you already have your items. So basically you just add a new row and then you give it a name and you fill in all those uh, um, uh, fields. Uh, the one on the top are the one that you have to fill them manually. But then the bottoms, if you want to fill them manually, fine. Otherwise, you can just click on the random stats and it will give you random stats for the price, all the armor uh, stats, weapon stats, and so on. Animations, you also need to do it manually, obviously. <coughs> And this is usable for your weapons. Now for the inventory system for this one, uh, I haven't hooked up anything here because basically the weapon system is not working. This is not a weapon system, this is an inventory system. But this is the idea if you wonder why it's there. So I already prepared it for you. And you can do some socket offset if in case you have things you know that doesn't exactly match your character. So maybe you you want to adjust its location or size or rotation or whatever uh, the backpack capacity it's only as you can see from the uh, tooltip it says use for backpack only otherwise it should be empty yep okay so this is I think this is the most important things that I wanted to show you if you have any questions, so please just head to my Discord and uh, ask whatever you want. Or in, uh, in the marketplace also there is a question section. Ask anything and I will try my best to answer you to the best I can. I don't know if I said this already but doesn't have to say it again. This will be included in the multiplayer game system. So buy it only if you need it for a separate project. Because, frankly speaking, extracting this from the multiplayer game system will not be straightforward. It might be a little bit tricky. But you do what you, what you want. Alright guys. So, thank you very much for watching. And I hope to see you very soon in Discord. Bye bye.